What's going on here, squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back. Once again, with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all of Zuri, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Monday, June 21st, and as I say each and every video, Smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the channel, just checking out the cycles, just checking out me in general, make sure you guys subscribe. That's the most important part. And when you subscribe, hit that notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out. Because sometimes I put out videos other than this daily video. I do like live streams of Call of Duty and stuff like that. But as a warning, when you watch my live streams of Call of Duty, make sure, I mean, it's not for the faint of hearts because it's grown men talking like grown men. So don't, I mean, it's uncensored. So when when we talk, I, don't, I mean, we talk like men talk amongst other men. It's a bunch of bull crapping. But that's just a warning. Make sure you guys join and talk with us. And talk with me. I will talk back when I do live stream and all kinds of stuff like that. But other than that, make sure you got, I mean, make sure you hit the notification bell for, so you guys can get each and every video every day. Because I do videos every day. But other than that, make sure, if you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Hitman Miyagi YT, how to spell that, will be in the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. It's down there, and it, I mean, it'll be down there until I change it. But that's how you spell the Twitter and Instagram. It, it's also in a hashtag below the video and in the description box below. Speaking of Madame Nazar, you don't see her on the screen, but I know where she is today. I did go to her. I did prepare for the video. I wasn't as clouded today but madame nazar's location today is down here in rio bravo she's in the rio bravo area you can see where my camp is that's a good spot for a camp um she's down here in the rio bravo area she will be down here until 2 a.m that's eastern standard time new york time zone east coast time zone for those of you who don't know or not of america how i personally get to her when she's in this spot is I move my camp down here in Rio Bravo. Make sure you move it to Rio Bravo and you may get a spot really close or you may get something up here somewhere along that dotted line or something like that. But that's the closest, the easiest way to get to her because there are no fast travels down in this area. So you have to ride a little bit. But if you get a camp, that's kind of close. I mean, you know, it wouldn't be such a long ride over such a, such of a problem. Um, well, after you get to her, just go back to your camp and fast travel out of there or open up your uh, wilderness camp. And if you got the ability to fast travel from there, fast travel out of there. Anywho, the next thing I want to get to is the Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle, is which is all the way up here in the cold, up in here. Or up here up here in culture right here at this waypoint right inside this house as soon as you walk through the door on the table or in, in the cupboard to the left as soon as you walk in the door that's where you should find your antique alcohol bottle which is the caribbean rum bottle there's also a tear card down or up here as well i wanted to tell you guys about Right over here, right across the way, inside this barn on a bale of hay, you will get a Ace of Cups tarot card. There's also a, I'll say it's about right here. There's a fossil. So come over here in this area with your metal detector. That's what you'll get, a random fossil. There's one up here as well. If you guys are looking for fossils, but remember to check the description box below because there's a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils. So 
go go get that. <laughs> All right, let's go down here to where we normally do do, do business, which is the Lemoyne area of the map, where I have all my markers and stuff. The cycles for today, Monday, June 21st, are Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Luxury Cycle 5, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 1, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Tarot Card Cycle 1, Bird Egg Cycle 5, and Fossils Cycle 2. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The, the cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Let's get to these things that we will find across the Lemoyne area of the map. I'm going to start up here, right under the word marsh. There's a bunch of islands above the word Lagrasse or Lagra. Right about here. Come right here at this location with your metal detector. Right at the base of the large tree. And you will get a random coin. Right here at this location. There's also a tarot card here and a tarot card on the back of the boat right here. Um, let's go all the way over here. Right here at this location, there's two things at this marker. One is inside the house, and the one that's inside the house is a Scotch whiskey bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is on the table to the right as soon as you walk into the shack. As soon as you walk in, Look to your right on that table with all the the um, candles. You should see a Scotch whiskey antique alcohol bottle. And right behind the house, right here at this location, come over here with your metal detector and you guys will get a random lost jury. If you guys want to cross the water right here at this location, there's two things over here, but the marker, the one at the marker, is a egret egg, E-G-R-E-T. It's in a tree. Shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. There's also a cardinal flower right about here if you guys want to grab that as well. Let's go over, all the way over before we go down. Right here at this location, you guys will get a fossil. This fossil is randomized. I cannot tell you guys what it is because it's randomized. Come right here at this location with your metal detector, and that's what you will dig up, a random fossil. Let's go down here to our next location over here by the E, which this is not it. I don't know why I put it right there, but right here at this location, you guys will get a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a ebony hairbrush. This ebony hairbrush is on a bench right here at the front of the back porch. If that made any sense to you guys, come over here, right here at this area. You should see a low, uh, a bench right here. You don't need a metal detector or anything like that. Come right here at this location. You should see a ebony hairbrush on a bench. Let's go over to the cemetery before we bounce back. Right here at this location, you guys will get a Rue Pearl Necklace. That's R-O-U Pearl Necklace. It's in the Fellows Grave Building right here at this location. Um, stand right here and look towards the marker, and that's what you will get. A Lost Jury, which is a Fellows, I mean a Rue Pearl Necklace. Let's go down a little bit to our next marker, which is a Antique Alcohol Bottle. This Antique Alcohol Bottle is a Irish Whiskey Bottle. How you get this bottle is there's a ladder here. Climb the ladder, go on the second level. Follow this path down to about right here. Jump across the railing and walk this path all across here. Jump across the railing there and follow the path around and to this marker, which is the antique alcohol bottle. Once again, that is a Irish whiskey antique alcohol bottle. Right about here, there's a corner cabinet sitting right on the side of the street 
inside that corner cabinet, you guys will find a, a Bello Ruby Bangle bracelet. This Bello Ruby Bangle bracelet is a lost jewelry. Uh, you have to open up the door to the cabinet and then position yourself in front of it again. And you should be prompt to grab the Abello Ruby Bangle bracelet out of it. Uh, let's go over to our next marker, which is right here. Right here at this location, you will see a table, a white table. And on that table, you should see a checkerboard or chessboard. And on that chessboard sits a Eight of Swords tarot card. Let's go down to our next marker, which I don't even want to get this one yet. We're going to pause. I have a couple more for you guys. A couple more extras right across from Gus. Uh, there's a statue. I mean, a fountain, I think right about here. And right against this wall, there's a treasure chest. Right inside that treasure chest, you guys will get a boxwood comb. There's a boxwood comb. It's in a big treasure chest right on the other side of the statue. And when that's there, there's also another family heirloom right about here. If you guys can see exactly where that is. Right down this alley on the ground floor, there's a bench right on this side of the street. Like right over here. <laughs> I can't point it to you guys, but right here at this location, you guys will see a bench. And on that bench, you will see a tortoiseshell cone right down this alley. Let's go over to the previous marker. Right here at this location, you will find a family heirloom, another family heirloom. This family heirloom is a carved wooden hairpin. This carved wooden hairpin is in a pile of trash. So come over here right at this location of this marker with your metal detector, and that's what you will dig up, a carved wooden hairpin family heirloom. Let's go over or up to our next marker which right here at this location, you guys will get a random coin. I cannot tell you what coin it is because they randomize the coin. But right here at this location, that's what you would dig up. Right next to the wagon, the small wagon that's in this area. At our next marker, you guys will find the cardinal flower that spawns over here each and every day. That helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on, which today is cycle one. It spawns all the way over here. There's about six spots that spawn over here that, you know, cardinal flowers spawn, different cycles, different areas. Anywho, <clears throat> after you grab that, right about here inside the building, come over here at this location with your metal detector, and you guys will dig up a random lost jury. Let's go, I wanna go over here to the Braithwaite Manor home. There's two things inside this home. If you guys feel like looking, one is on the ground floor dinner table. There's a London dry gin bottle. And on top of the piano in the corner of the room inside the house on the ground floor, you guys will see a Ace of Wands tarot card. I have a couple more things for you inside of Rhodes which I have two more markers, but there's a card right here. This is on the second floor of this building on the table. Walk up the stairs and on, and you guys will get a King of Cups tarot card. There's also right here, I think on a bench, right here at this location on a bench on the front porch of this house, you guys will get a two of wands. And right over here next to a bucket, right at this location, you guys will get another tarot card, which is a 10 of cups. Let's go to the, or the next to last marker. Right here at this location of this marker, you guys will get a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a rosewood hairbrush. This roll with hairbrush is inside a treasure chest right here at the edge of the railroad station. It's like right here on the little walkway. So come right here at the, the corner of this building and that's what you will get. A rosewood hairbrush. While you're over here, there's a lost jury right in front of a outhouse right here at this lo location. 
It's like a broken down outhouse right here. So come over here with the metal detector. And that's what you will get, a random lost jury. The last marker that I do have for you guys, which is up here, right at Matic Pond, right on the side, there's a random arrowhead. I cannot tell you guys what arrowhead you guys will get. But right here beside a tree stump, you guys will get a random arrowhead. You do not need your metal detector for this. You just need your shovel. You need the ability to dig because it's a dig spot. So when you do come in this area, make sure you hit your eagle eye and that's how you should see it. Unless you just know what you're looking for. Anywho, let's um, go back out a little bit. Right here, I mean, well, once again, the cycles for today, uh, Monday, June 21st, are Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Auxiliary Cycle 5, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 1, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Tarot Card Cycle 1, Bird Egg Cycle 5, and Fossils Cycle 2. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Auxiliary Cycle 5, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 1, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Tarot Card Cycle 1, Bird Egg Cycle 5, and Fossils Cycle 2. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching, looking, listening, uh, subscribing, um, commenting, and all the other good stuff. I did see comments like when I before I started the video, I didn't get a chance to look at them. I don't know if those are new comments that I didn't get to read or anything, but um, I didn't get a chance. I didn't see anything pop up on my phone, so I couldn't reply or anything. But I hope somehow your questions got answered. If not, um, I will try to get to them after this video. But um, thank you guys for everything. And if you haven't, if you don't, remember to like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. Uh, that's pretty much it for me today. Thank you guys for watching. It's your main man, Hitman, and I'm out.